Hi, I'm glad you could take this moment to stop with me and pray. I decided to sit here in front of this tree that I'm not sure I know what it is yet. Because since I have only lived in the house a couple months, I don't know what seasons and what new wonders the yard will bring. What I see is little green fruit. So it could be that it's a baby of the lemon tree and hasn't ripened yet. But it could also be an offshoot of the orange tree and hasn't ripened yet. Or it could be an offshoot of this weird grapefruit that's really big and has a thick skin that I've never eaten. It belongs to my neighbor. But since it's the beginning of summer, I like this image of this tree that I'm not sure I know what it is. I mean, I know I could look it up and find out what it is, but it's that joy of discovery, the joy of waiting to find out what all these little fruits are going to turn into. And then the joy of discovering how I will be able to use those fruits. In our scriptures this week about Pentecost, one of the selections is from Psalm 104, where it says, when you send forth your spirit, they are created and you renew the face of the ground. May the glory of the Lord endure forever. And when I think about this tree and its renewal of the ground, that it decided it could come up out of the plastic and the mulch that had been spread and create this little bush that is blooming. The face of the ground being renewed. That if given enough time, the earth will replenish itself, will send forth all those things that we thought were lost. So I invite us to settle in, close your eyes, and breathe deeply. Letting your breath go in and out. Feeling your breath settle all the way down into the pit of your stomach, into the bottom of your lungs. Hold it for a second and then release that breath. That breath, Ruha the very breath of God, the spirit of God, the spirit sent to renew us, to renew the land. Think about that. The spirit, the breath of God blowing across the land, bringing renewal. Can you picture it? Can you see the new life sprouting up? Holy Spirit, as we turn to you and ask you to come among us, to come among us and renew the face of the ground, we ask you to flow across those places where violence seems to have no end, where war and guns have taken root. Blow your spirit through them. Blow your spirit through them, renewing the ground. Holy Spirit, blow. Blow to those places of the earth in need of renewal. Those places and people facing trouble from droughts and floods and fire. Send your spirit to renew the face of the ground. Holy One, send your spirit to renew the face of the ground to our families and our friends, our neighbors and relatives. The people we know that need your renewal, 
that need that breath of life, that breath to flow through them and with them and among them. We lift them up to you now. Holy Spirit, God sends you forth to renew the face of the ground. And so we ask God to send forth the Holy Spirit to renew the face of our ground. Amen.